It's no secret that Ukraine is a defense tech innovator. The key objective of this event is to develop an effective combination of several technologies in a single product, a kamikaze aircraft. We are presenting a new development of a repeater and strike aircraft that will hit targets at a distance of 40 plus kilometers. And how do you fly? You'll see shortly. One of the key problems with using kamikaze planes is the radio horizon and enemy electronic warfare. The biggest obstacle for us is the curtain, an electronic warfare system that works on video signals, preventing you from seeing any images. The second problem is the radio horizon. To fly from point A to point B, you need a direct connection. To ensure this, you need to raise your antennas high. Signal retransmission is the technology that will help you fly to point B. Now, everyone is trying to find a new method of warfare, I guess. This is a good testing ground where you can try something, come up with new ideas, find something for yourself and for your country. Only here can we see whether it is effective, whether it works, and if it's worth spending the funds our department manages. And here, we can decide for ourselves who we want to continue working with and who isn't really the best use of our time and money. This is an opportunity to directly connect the military with manufacturers. And it is also a testing ground for several companies. We have gained a lot of experience during the war. Manufacturers come to us from Europe for consultations to see how we work and how we fly. New frequencies are emerging, new control options are appearing, and the possibility of unmanned flights and autonomous systems is emerging. You always have to keep up with trends in the world and on the battlefield, and try to develop in the same direction and adapt to them all. Uh, today, you have an audience of, uh, of different drone units across the Ukrainian army that are watching to see the results. And if all things work out, well, you'll see these drones on the battlefield pretty soon.